Good morning. It's a great day for learning at Handring Middle School. Please stand and join me in singing the Pledge of the Flag and remain standing for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated. Today is Monday, day three on your schedule. Happy birthday today to Ethan Brem and Tyler Hawes. Today's hero for Native American History Month is Deb Holland. Deb Holland became one of the first two Native American women elected to Congress in 2018. She became the first Native American to be elected to a cabinet, cabinet secretary in position in 2021. The next STEM club meeting is Tuesday, November 8th, directly after school in room 223. Attention HMS students and staff. This year we will be having a, the turkey trot for all grades on November 22nd to benefit Oshai's Children's Hospital. A $2 or more donation is encouraged. We will go 1.4 miles around the school in snow or shine. If you would like to order a t-shirt, be sure to return your t-shirt order from your social studies teacher. All forms are due November 9th. Donations will be accepted through November 22nd. Hamburg High School is collecting non-perishable food items in their annual Thanksgiving food drive in November. Please bring canned or boxed food items to donate for this worthy cause. Place your donations in the bins in the main hallway. Choose your bin carefully. It will count as votes towards someone wearing a turkey costume on November 22nd. You could bring in a frozen turkey. It will count as 10 votes. All turkeys can be dropped off in room 104. Donations are due by November 17th. Gobble, gobble. Fact Service Club will another, another meeting today, November 7th. We will meet in the sewing room, room 120, and we will be helping make bears for French week. Please sign up outside room 120 if interested. Like to swim? Not doing a sport in the winter yet? Join the modified swim team. All are welcome. Sign up on Family ID. The first practice is November 28th. Check out the team website for more information. Attention Washington, Washington DC trip students. There is a new fundraiser happening now. Pick up a fundraiser packet in Mrs. Sperry's room, room 118A. Sell gourmet popcorn to earn profit towards your trip, room 118A. Grab a fundraiser packet today. Attention HMS, today until November 8th, donate any of your Halloween candy to the Trees for Truths candy drive. Donation boxes will be located in the main hallway and upstairs by the LMC. All candy will be packaged up and donated to the Niagara Falls Air Force Base in time for Veterans Day. This week is the start of Solidarity Week. Please show your support for our LGBTQ community by picking up a free ribbon and wearing it all week long. Don't forget to wear your prideful colors this Thursday to show your support. There will be an art club meeting on Tuesday, November 8th, after school in room 2 in 127. Please see Google Classroom for supplies you need to bring in. Woodworking Club Group A will, will meet Tuesday, November 8th. Stop in the library to check out our display of books for Indigenous Peoples Month. And good morning, Hamburg Middle School. Hope you had a decent weekend. Let's not talk about certain things that happened yesterday afternoon. And might I say, let's not panic about what happened yesterday afternoon. With our beloved Buffalo Bills, things will get better. Thank you. Uh, today I'm going to introduce, we are going to introduce uh, our character trait of the month for November. This is something that we haven't done officially for September and October, but we are going to start doing it each month. There will be a few different components of it. I won't go at length about that right now. Uh, but today's or this month's character trait that we are lifting up is simply this, caring. So caring for one another, caring for yourself, caring for the world around you, including this school. The announcements, you heard two really specific ways that you can care about others. One way is by donating a portion of your Halloween candy to Treats for Troops. 
that is, I will say, an easy way to show people who care about us that we care about them. Another way that you can do it is by participating in the food drive that the high school runs, but that we do a great job of contributing to. You'll see those bins out by the main hallway. Those are the teachers and staff members who have volunteered that if they, if their box contains the most food items, they'll wear that turkey costume on November 22nd. But of course, it's more than just about that. It is about caring. It's about caring for our community. It's about caring for uh, those who are struggling at a certain time, uh, which certainly can apply to all of us. So we've got real examples of caring for each other and caring for others as well. Uh, let's do a, do a good job with that as well. Let me extend that a little bit. Um, you know that there's been illness that people have been, been hit with in terms of families, maybe you and staff as well. So we certainly have our share of guest teachers in the building, substitutes who have come in. We show our caring by treating them decently as well. They're caring enough about us to be here. Please show that you care about them by being decent and listening to what uh, the, the directions and the lessons that they are asked to deliver as well. So I want to put a special thanks to our substitute teachers who are here today with us also. This concludes your morning announcement. Have a magical Monday and ask yourself, how can you be an 11 today?